hey guys what's up and welcome back to another vlog um i feel like crap to be honest and i know words are very powerful and right now i feel like crap my leg is killing me so badly i had a cramp yesterday but i wasn't expecting it to like continue until today and i have to go to work in like less than two hours and i'm getting worried and i feel really over bloated and I have these weird blisters in my tongue. Like, when you know when you drink hot and you burn your tongue and then I like, get a blister? That's basically what happens. But for some reason, I was drinking a pineapple. Mmm. Drinking a pineapple smoothie that was cold. Maybe that's why. Um, my body, lower body hurts. My thighs really is killing me. I don't know how I'm going to do it. Hey, guys. So... I took a nap and honestly it made me feel a lot better. I just have a minor headache now. So that's great. Um, I ended up taking these babies right over here because for some reason I feel really bloated. And I just think I might get my period. So because I'm also breaking out a lot down there. I will see you guys at night time. I am off to work. It is going to be a full, t full shift basically. So wish me luck and I will see you guys later. Hey guys, what's up and welcome back to vlog mess. Now, I know I've been out for a day, two days actually, because today's going to be another day. Um, yeah, two days, because I'm, I'm going to edit this clip from tonight and post it tomorrow in the morning. And then I'll see if I'm able to post yesterday's, I mean, it was like a mini vlog. It's not really like a high vlog like we always have. But anyways, on today's video, I just wanted to show you guys what me and Babe did. Mostly Babe did, which is like actually pretty freaking dope. Look at this. This one's going to go here onto replacing that one. And we're just going to add some silver details, which I could not freaking find for some reason. So I'm pretty bummed out. But I still have a few more to go through to do that style. But you guys, we have some packages that we have to go ahead and, you know, show off. I'm just kidding. Just so basically some things that I bought. Mm. I said I was going to buy makeup. So, babe, don't watch this video. Skip on to it. So let's go ahead. I went ahead and I got myself a new Morphe spray. Which is considered the Mist Me, Mist You. It's so cute. It's a duo. It's just a continuing um, misting spray. Except in this in the color gold. Which honestly I do really like their misting spray. I think it's a cute gift idea. Then we went ahead and got lashes. Now I bought magnetic lashes online through Amazon. Which I really do like them. The only thing is that the glue does go up my eyelid after wearing them for a while. I do have oily eyelids. But I also have a hooded eye compared to this one. So this one's the one that they always stick to on top. You guys literally like my nose is like running really bad. Ugh, my lighting sucks here. Hold on. I'm gonna look skinny for the camera. Just kidding. No, I don't care. Okay. So then we went ahead and I got again... I just wanted to try their lashes from them. So I went ahead and I bought some. So I got this one, which is the consider the number. What are you? What number? Oh, this is the. Doesn't even tell you the. So it doesn't say which one it is. But it's this one right over here. It is their magnetic one. Then I have like a couple of magnetic ones that I bought. We also ended up buying this one, which this is a sleeping mask. And honestly, I really do like using sleeping masks, especially to help me with my face and my acne. And I ended up getting this one from Coco Kine. It is for all types. So I'm going to be doing a skin review upon this one. This one's basically an overnight mask with plant-derived retinol. And it's really good. Retinol is really good for your skin. Moving on, I went ahead and grabbed some more eyelashes because I'm running low on lashes. I wanted to go ahead and grab something different, which I ended up getting the sequence lashes but i kind of feel like i regret them. they're a little bit too extra out you know what i mean but then i also ended up getting these which i was like really surprised these are the drama to max it is from the kiss the lash couture these are limited edition and these look pretty freaking badass look at this the the lash line is a little bit thicker than i would like but we'll see you know how that works out drama which they look like spy lashes. Like, <laughs> and for Kiss, last but not least, we got another pair of eyelashes. These are the 11 eyelash, which I've never tried these before. Oh, no. Actually, these are the ones I always get. Oh, they have a new different box. That's why. These are the ones I always get also at Walgreens when I have them. They should be the five pairs, but they also come in six pairs, and they're like the same freaking price. But five pairs is all I had here. 
I've been juggling with trying to figure out what's the best skin tone foundation for me from the Julia Cosmetic, but I love their foundation so much. So I went ahead and I grabbed a different shade. This one's Casablanca. And then I grabbed a darker shade of their concealer because the one I have is like really light. So then we also went ahead and grabbed some eyeliners. Oh no, it's an eyeliner and a mascara. I went ahead and grabbed this one, which is the felt tip eyeliner. Someone ended up requesting it or actually someone ended up commenting on my picture um letting me know that this is actually a good eyeliner so i went ahead and i bought it and see what's going on because i tried one of the kiss liners and it's good but it does smudge it off this one the eyeliner i'm currently wearing it is from nyx and it is their wing liner the um i can't recall i'm actually pretty excited to open this let's see what flavors i got i can't recall what flavors i got but I know that they were having a sale of buy one and get one free, which I was like, oh, I need it. It's actually like a really good steal deal. So I was like, why not? You know, let's go ahead and grab some. These are good for your system, you guys. Trust me. Like, they make your tummy feel a little bubbly and weird, but they're really good for you. So we have, this is actually one of my favorite ones. It is the Bubbly Rose. Then we also have, ooh, the Watermelon. Also, we have, ooh, I've never tried this one, the pomegranate. And I believe they're, are they all the same? Oh, no, they're all different. Ooh, the pink lady, yummy. What else we have? Okay, I've never tried this one, the tropical punch. Honestly, I drink these in two days. I don't drink it all at once. This one is a passion fruit and tango. Which one should we drink first? What am I going to drink any today at all? because then I'm gonna have to go go see you guys in a bit hey guys I have missed you guys so freaking much um work has been terrible the reason why I have not been vlogging for vlogmas and I hate it because I do this every year I start off good the first week and the second week is like man and just everything goes downfall um unfortunately at our job they are not disclosing this information but I feel that it is kind of like true I believe that our main GM got COVID and they're not telling us, which by law, I get it because they don't have to tell us until next year. But I mean, we're managers, so we should know what's going on, especially because we all talk in the same place and we're always all in the same location. And I mean, having communication of, hey, like, you know, let's go ahead and get tested to see what's a 411. Um, that's something I feel like they should have told us. So she did get tested on Monday, and today is Tuesday. So she should be getting her results. Wait, today's Tuesday? Is it today's Tuesday or today's Wednesday? Yeah, today's Tuesday. Sorry, I'm off. It's today's Tuesday, the 15th. So she should definitely be disclosing it to us to see if she is positive or not, so we could all go ahead and get tested. Um, I have not been quarantined. I have been working, and I've been doing full shifts. So I'm very exhausted. Uh, my glory days hasn't came through, so I am also very stressed too. So it, that kind of prevents my glory days from coming. But it's been a hectic of a month. Definitely I started strong, and I'm so sorry the fact that I, I'm i not continuing Vlogmas. I really do want to, and I am going to push it my best to try. We just have to see how it's going on. I have not had a day off, and I worked the full 12-hour shift yesterday. Um, Came home, ate drink a little bit and just knocked out today i do go in a little bit more later on i did some prepping for myself i was just in my own zone catching up upon social media which i think i should have just been reading instead i did my skincare i put a little bit of eyeliner you know just a little bit i combed my hair because my hair was a hot mess um it's just you know it's been it's just me basically until right now that i'm talking to you guys because i really do miss vlogging and just having a conversation and showing you guys what I do on a day but I'm gonna see if I could vlog maybe little clips of what I actually do at work maybe maybe not I don't know we get in trouble so I don't really want to get in trouble right now and they're really on us our district manager is always spying on us on the cameras which is like okay but yes I just want to let you guys know that I am doing okay all my family is safe I'm safe did this is safe not safe we're safe thank god um, but yeah, we're just trying to see what's going on. Then we had another GM, well, not GM, ASM that called off yesterday. And now because she called off, I have to go and work a little bit more longer as well. 
So we're busting a lot of longer shifts than we should have. Which at the end, yes, it's good money, but taxes are going to kill me because this company does not remove my taxes at all. So with that being said, I need to be saving up most of the money anyways. But anyways, I yapped a lot on this video. <laughs> I love you guys. Stay safe and I'll see you guys soon, hopefully. Thank you.